there, there is, um, let me, if I give an example of a lady that had prolapsed the disc in January and had had the opportunity of seeing a consultant neurologist because she had uh, potentially serious corda equina syndrome, which needs emergency surgery. The surgeon had decided to use a wait and see approach and had given her advice to um, not to have the surgery. She has come to see us and she has been through my treatment couch with osteopathy and I've referred it into the Pilates Rehabilitation Studio and she is now doing very well indeed. The sciatic pain has all gone from her leg, her muscles in her leg have come back to work again and she's looking forward to joining a back care class. Um, at the clinic soon. So she's gone from really that, that broken to getting much stronger, much better. Um, it's lovely to see how the human body, given the right environment, can fix itself. And it's up to us as practitioners to just remove those obstacles that stop you being the best you can be. I was thinking of a lady who has osteoporosis and currently attends some of the Buff Bones osteoporosis specific mat work classes that I teach. And I think seeing someone go from a very scared place of worry about what might happen in their body and then seeing how through sharing our top tips on how to move better, how to bend and lift and do all of those functional daily activities, walk the dog and improve on balance means that that original diagnosis that was really fearful suddenly becomes a little bit less fearful and they just feel so empowered to be able to move more confidently through the rest of their days. It's Just wonderful. for example, um, <clears throat> with a hip replacement, we'll see a patient for rehabilitation will start that two weeks after surgery. And we have in the rehabilitation studio these machines that allow you to move without full gravity, the springs that assist you. And seeing the joy on someone's face, they have a hip replacement, and then when they're doing a, a leg press on the machine on that new hip, and it all works and it doesn't hurt, then the tears can come because suddenly they realise their life is going to be better, that they will be able to do the garden, play with the grandchildren and do the things that they couldn't do before. It's, it's a joy to it come to work for that. An absolute privilege and an honour. Mm. Thank you. Um.